Hi again, everybody. My name is Greg Anderson, and this is The Good Timekeeping Show with Greg Anderson. Now, I know some people ask me, or they're, they're at least curious about it, hey, since I talk about clocks and watches, you know, Casio watches all the time, do, do those companies ever reach out to me and give me like free stuff as a way to thank me or somehow compensate me for all the publicity that I give to them? And the answer is no. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I've never uh, reached out to Casio asking for free stuff, and they've never reached out to me in any way about anything. So uh, f as far as I know, uh, Casio has no idea I even exist and not paying any attention to this channel at all. And that's okay. You know, I, I do get paid a little bit by YouTube because my videos are kind of popular. So it, it's enough to kind of make it so... Um, I can afford to buy some new watches now and then and, and do reviews on them. But I usually, I pick my watches because those are watches that I actually want and not just because I want to make a video about them. So that's how that works. But there is one fellow who, who gave me a gift when he came by a few months ago. Patrick from Geocron uh, took note of uh, the way I was talking about Geocrons. And again, I would have talked about Geocrons anyway, and I will continue to do so without expecting any anything from uh, Patrick or, you know, anyone associated with the company. Uh, he gave me a gift. It was not a Geocron. He didn't give me a free Geocron, nothing like that. But he did give me something that is a component of a Geocron that actually was really, really cool. And it's this thing right here. This is a transparency. This is a piece of uh, what would be installed in a mechanical Geocron. And so this is the same exact thing they would put inside one. So there's a backlight in a, in a mechanical geocron uh, behind this. And then little things that, that create the shade. So you get that effect of showing where the Terminator line is and where it's nighttime and where it's daytime. So what they do is they take a transparency like this, which is a complete map of the world, and then they will attach it to another one uh, right next to it, and kind of make a like a seamless map there, and then continue that out. So they have a loop of these things, multiple maps that are continually rolling around inside the geocron. And uh, you know, as the map moves to indicate uh, the movement of the Earth, then um, these things move through here. So this is just one of those that, if it were used in a mechanical geocron, you know, they would have multiple ones all stitched together seamlessly. But this is the transparency, and when he gave it to me, it was just rolled up, you know, just, just a piece of film, if you will. So then I went downtown and I got a frame for it with the glass and everything, so it's really nice. And I'm trying to figure out a way I can maybe rig up some sort of simple LED backlight behind it and then we'll hang it up somewhere. He says some people, when they get these, they just hang it up in the window, you know, and let the sunlight shine through it, and that's kind of fun too. But I wanted to keep it really nice. So that's what I got as just a free... Uh, friendly gift from from Patrick when he decided to come out and visit. And he came out to visit because he had decided he wanted to visit every state and uh, just just chat with someone who had a geocron in every single state. And this is just for the fun of it for him. He gets to go see the country, meet some people with the common interests and have some fun that way. So he, you know, he came to visit me and that's a little gift he gave me. It also has some uh, autographs on here from some of the folks that work at Geocron. They autographed this for me. So, you know, I framed it up nice and I'll, I'll find just the perfect place to put that. Um, and maybe that'll be a precursor to someday I'll actually get a, a fully functional uh, mechanical geocron, you know, with my own funding. So, so that's, anyway, that's kind of special. That's kind of fun. And, you know, Patrick compared it to, and I think it's, a, it's an apt comparison to like uncirculated currency. If you're a coin collector or you collect, uh, you know, bills, uh, paper money from different places, if you can get some that's been uncirculated, or I was thinking also of maybe those things where like you get a sheet of uh, twenty one dollar bills, all in one sheet, as they came off the printing press before they cut them into individual bills. You know, they used to. I, I don't see it so much anymore. We used to in catalogs. You could order that sheet of uncut dollar bills. So if you have uncut bills, uncirculated currency, uh, that's kind of what this is. This is a piece of transparency that was, um, you know, it was something they could have used and uh, put it into a mechanical geocron. But instead, you know, he pulled a few aside that he could give away uh, to people. And I was one of the lucky recipients of that. So 
<laughs> and so that's uh, the gift I received just as a friendly thing. But no, I don't get uh, free watches or even free complete geocrons. Um, I know, and I don't expect that. I don't know how things like that work in the real world. But um, so far, it doesn't work that way for me. And again, that's okay. As long as Casio makes uh, watches that I can afford to buy, uh, they don't need to send me free watches. And uh, as long as I've got a cool geocron device, uh, no one needs to send me one for free. Okay. So that's all for now. Hey, I've got more uh, videos coming up soon. So I hope you will join me again soon for another episode of the Good Timekeeping Show.